G'day, I'm Lockie from Miner's Den Bendigo and tonight's top tip on the Mine Lab show, I'm going to show you how to correctly set the sensitivity on your SDC 2300. Our SDC sensitivity level is hugely important while we're out detecting. We can see we have some salt settings here, indicated by the blue, and then we start to get into our normal sensitivity settings here, which are indicated by the orange and the green. The green one is there as a factory preset and if you need to go back to factory settings for some reason, it's indicated by the green number there. Now, we have five levels of sensitivity. The higher I go with my sensitivity, the better amplification I'm going to get on targets. Now, that can mean gold or lead, any target that comes through the detector, but it also starts to amplify EMI or electrical magnetic interference and as well as our ground mineralizations. So we need to start to choose which one is going to be most applicable to the ground we're detecting. If I was to grab a detector out, I'd highly suggest setting number three. It's one above factory preset, and it starts to give me a little bit more ampl amplification when I start to get to the, into the small target range. Now, factory preset is two. It's going to make the machine nice and stable and quiet. I don't want to run any higher than probably four. Uh, I'm just going to start to hear too much interference, too many ground noises, and I'll start to drown out my targets instead of actually hearing targets. So for a start, I'd probably suggest number three. And if you're starting to get a bit more advanced with your SDC, jump up to four and give it a go. What I'm going to do now is change my sensitivity from number two to four. Now, because the SDC is waterproof, we have to lift up the dial to turn it to disengage the o-ring so once i lift up i'm going to go all the way to four and i can see the white line is on number four and i've set it at there now my detector is set on sensitivity four i'm going to set it up i'm going to go for a detect and see what amplification i'm getting from ground noise and interference and if it is too much i'm going to drop it from four down to three or where i'm not getting any false noises well, there you go guys, that's how I set up my SDC sensitivity. Just remember, if you're starting to get false noises from the ground or the interference, I'd try a noise cancel first, and if that doesn't work, I'd drop my sensitivity down. I'm Lockie from Miner's Den Bendigo, and that's been tonight's top tip on the Mine Lab show.